Hi class, it's Mrs. Lawson. Welcome to my kitchen. I'm so glad that you are here today to do some math with me. I have a bit of a riddle. I want you to try to figure out what these things have in common. I have some wooden spoons and I have a recorder. That's awful. And I have a water bottle and I have a ruler. What do you think oh, all of these things have in common? I want you to think about it. Think, think, think. What is similar or what is alike for all of them? I'm going to give you a hint. It has a lot to do with the ruler. Did you guess it? All of them are the same length or height, I guess, for my water bottle. Let's measure. The first one is my wooden spoon. I'm going to measure it. And it is about the same height or length as my ruler. Hmm. Do you know how long my ruler is? I guess it sort of depends on where you live. Here in Canada, we would say that it is 30 centimeters. But in other places, they would say it's one foot or 12 inches. Have you ever noticed that on rulers? On one side, the numbers go up to 12. And then if you flip it over, the numbers go up to 30. The 30 side is the centimeter side. And there are 30 centimeters on this ruler. The other side, the side with the 12, are inches. There's 12 inches in one foot. And that is how long my wooden spoon is. It's 12 inches, one foot, or 30 centimeters. And both of my wooden spoons are the same height. So they're both one foot. Now, I have been stuck at home and right before we had to stay at home, my mom gave my children two recorders. Worst present ever. But it is about one foot. Oh, well, maybe a little bit bigger. Or 30 centimeters or 12 inches. And how about my water bottle? Look. It also is about the same length or height as my ruler. Rulers are about one foot in length or 30 centimeters. We would use a ruler when we wanted to measure something that wasn't really very big. Can you imagine measuring a whole road with a ruler? No! We would need something much bigger than that. Rulers are great when we're measuring little things. Hmm. Can you think of some fun things around your house that might be the same length as a ruler? I would love for you to find some. Take your ruler around the house and see what is the same length or height as your ruler. And then let me know what you found that was one foot or 30 centimeters and let me know what you found. Hmm. We use a ruler when something is small. If we want to measure something that is larger, we might use something like this. And it just keeps going and going and going. Or maybe you have a toolbox in your garage and there is a measuring tape in it and it would measure things that are much longer or taller as well. I think we should have some fun measuring today. Let me know what you measured. 
Have a great day, class. Bye-bye.